And we're back here on AUPanthers.tv following a 77-45 victory for the Adelphi women's basketball team. Kevin Dexter now joined by Samantha Brenner. Thanks for the time. Congrats on the win. Thank you. Adelphi improving to 15-1 and overall, 8-1 and in the Northeast 10. And Samantha, you weren't on this team last year, but I'm sure you know that you guys lost to Bentley in the Northeast 10 title game. Was there a little bit of a sense of revenge making this a statement game with a big win tonight? Yeah, this is definitely a game that we circled on our calendar three months ago, even right. in summer. So I think we were really proud of our effort and yeah I'm really happy for the girls. Do you think that led to even more of an effort for your team especially on the defensive end where you held them to 14 points in the first half? Yes definitely there's a little bit of a personal touch when right. we beat Bentley especially in your home court so uh, yeah definitely the extra effort. Now you had a tough defensive assignment tonight Demma second in the conference in scoring second in rebounding the star player for Bentley you were able to really keep her in check for the most part before you ended up fouling out in the second half what was it that matchup, and what were you able to do to really hold her down? Well, I think my height is definitely an advantage. Um, it's definitely an advantage I've seen coming down in D2. Uh, so my plan was to try to not let her get the ball, and if she does, just sit behind her, hands up. She, try not to let her score over me. But, yeah, we really stuck to the game plan. So. Well, as well as you guys have played this season, at times rebounding has been an area where you've struggled against certain teams. You come out and dominate the rebounding battle 54-23. to what was the key tonight in being able to really take control of the glass? We really talked about, like, second effort. So we work really hard in the 30 seconds, and then we miss a rebound. So we talked about second effort, go get the rebound. So, again, sense of urgency that it's Bentley. I think that really keyed in just to go get it. Well, offensively, you've seen a lot more over the past couple of games, a lot of balance on this team. Kelly Maddox with 19 tonight. Uh, Callie Balfour at 16, but everybody else, you chipped in with a couple of buckets. Seemed like everybody really chipped in tonight. Is that where you guys want to be offensively, where it's not one player really controlling, where everybody's chipping in? Yeah, we want to be the team that when someone puts a scout on us, we have all 14 girls in the scout. Right. We don't have just eight girls that we go to, and this was a great game that everyone chipped in a couple points. M came in, got a steal. Nat got a couple rebounds, so it was really good. Well, how do you feel where this team's confidence is? You lose at Stonehill, maybe sets you back a little bit. You don't play your best on Saturday against St. A's, but now coming back with a big win tonight. Yeah, Coach always says that she doesn't believe that we need to lose to learn a lesson, but we learned a lesson, and I think we took it to heart, so it definitely helped. And, yeah, this is, this is our year. So. Well, finally, two in a row coming up on the road. You know you're going to get everybody's best being the top team in the conference now. How do you prepare for a little bit of a road swing now? Yeah, we know that we have a target on our back, and I think especially with the loss of Stonehill, everyone's like, oh, okay, we can beat them, but we're going to go into every game and be like, no, you can't beat us. So, yeah, we go into every game, especially on the road. We do well on the road, so I think – take the same urgency as we do at home, we'll be fine. All right, well, congrats on the win. Thanks again for the time. Thank Samantha you. Brenner after a 77-45 win for Adelphi. We'll be right back with the men's game coming up in about 20 minutes. For Tom Verde and our entire crew, I'm Kevin Dexter. Thanks for watching. The Panthers improve to 15-1 and 8-1 in any 10 play.